Isn't she the best? Now who's gonna clean that up? I'll let her know with that. Not a bad office view. <laughs> This is Mike Media Manager Liz. She's the whole reason our business is successful. Just wanted to point that out. All right, just got through like 120 emails sitting in my inbox. Done. And do more. So not every one of these vlogs is gonna be me on the road, traveling, doing stuff like that. A lot of it is going to be me just talking to you because I want these to actually be useful. Yes, I wanna show you my day-to-day -day life. I wanna go do some cool stuff but I want them to be useful to you. So today, in honor of my 31st birthday, which is today, or if you're watching this, yesterday, I'm going to talk about how to get everything you want in life. That's a super bold statement, and it sounds really clickbaity and probably new agey, but I'm going out on a limb, and I'm gonna talk about it anyway, because to be perfectly honest, I've been pretty lucky in life. Like, it, I've really... I don't know, I've accomplished just about everything I hoped to do by the time I was 31 years old. I've got a fantastic wife. I've got great family and friends. Uh, I bought a house right on the outskirts of downtown Portland. But most importantly, I get to help people every single day achieve their dreams through Location Rebel. And that's really, really cool to me. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about five different things that I think are crucial to being able to get everything that you want in life. If you want the entire list of 31, Below, there's a link to the blog post that I wrote on seanogle.com. It's like almost 5,000 words. It's one of the longer posts I've written in a long time. So if you want that, go check it out. But in this post, we're going to give you five tips, five strategies, five things that I think are going to help you. First, foremost, absolute most important thing. Number one, know what you want. And I mean like really know what you want. Not like, oh, I want to quit my job and travel the world, but why do you want to do that? What do you want your life to look like? What, you know, think about the different categories of your life, work, relationships, community, money and finances. What do you specifically want out of each of those things? So many people tell me that they want to, you know, quit their job and travel the world. And I say, why? Or what do you want to do? You know, what is, what is the reason for doing that? And they're kind of like, oh, I don't know, I'm not very happy. I, I don't really know what I, I don't know what I want to do. That's not going to cut it. If you're going to make drastic changes, if you're going to get everything you want out of life, you have to understand why you're doing it. Because if you don't understand why, you're not going to have the motivation to actually do the work and follow through with it. So think about that. Think about all the different aspects of your life. Think about what you really want out of those things and understand why you want to do it and you're gonna be way ahead of the game. Number two, thing number two to getting everything you want in life is understand you can have anything you want. You just can't have everything you want all at once. So you can still get everything you want throughout the course of your life. But if you say, say you want a big house and you wanna take five star vacations four times a year and you wanna drive a Ferrari every single day, Realistically, you're probably not going to be able to have all of those things right away unless you win the lottery or become like some crazy CEO. And that's going to be years down the road is my guess. But if all you cared about, if you said the thing I want the most right now is to own a Ferrari. While that may seem really difficult, it's actually, if that was the one thing you wanted, it's probably more attainable than you think. You know, figure out what it costs to, you know, put money down on a Ferrari. Maybe you get a used one. Maybe you get one that's like, call it $80,000. Really expensive car, but you could probably get a, you know, 2001 Ferrari 360 for around 70 or 80 grand. Figure out what the monthly payments are gonna be. 1,500 bucks a month, 2,000 bucks a month. If that's all you care about, you can make that happen. Like that's totally attainable. If you're making, you know, six, $7,000 a month, but all you care about is driving that Ferrari, you can make that happen. Sure, you can't have the travel and you can't have the house and you can't have all those things on top of it, but if that's what you want, you can do it. 
So think about that. You can have anything you want right now. Within the next few years, you could probably have anything you want. You just can't have everything. So be willing to prioritize. So here's a more tactical thing you can do. When I was in my day job, I found this photo of this bungalow on a beach in Thailand. And it was absolutely gorgeous, like clear blue water, palm trees. It was amazing. I found out that bungalow was actually a hostel and only cost $30 a night to stay at. I saved that photo as my wall, uh, my wallpaper on my desktop computer. So every day when I went to work and I fired my computer up, that's what I saw. That bungalow staring me right in the face. So think about what's the thing that's going to motivate you. Is it a photo of a car, a house, a tropical place? Is it a photo of your kids? What is the thing that's gonna you're going to look at every single day and be like, can't wait to get down to work because I want that. So for me, it was that photo. And for almost a year, I looked at that photo until I ended up, it wasn't the same place, but I ended up at a very similar place in a very similar bungalow thinking, hey, this worked. That was pretty cool. All right, Sean, it's your last day in the Maldives here. You've gotten lazy. You've had a good couple of years had a lot of success, but you've gotten lazy and it's time to get back to work. If you want this lifestyle, if you want this pool, if you want this view, if you want these vacations, if you want this life, do the work. Get back to work. No more afternoon naps. No more being lazy. Take care of yourself. Take care of your body. Eat well. Work out. And put in the work. Put in the hours to make sure that you get what you want in life and that you deserve it. Stop slacking off, get back to work, get the lifestyle you want. Do the work, live the life. All right, don't let me down. This is the toughest part of getting what you want, but it's also one of the most essential. Cultivate discipline. Recently, I've kind of realized I'm not the most disciplined person in the world. In fact, I'm not disciplined at all with anything. And this has been a difficult realization for me, but the more disciplined I've slowly become and the more I've made that the priority, not the work itself, just being disciplined with everything I wanna do in life because the work comes along with that, the more I get the things I want and the more I start seeing things happen. So discipline will win out over smarts, over luck, over anything else. If you're disciplined and you put in the work day in and day out and you're consistent with it, you will get everything you want in life over the course of your lifetime, guaranteed. You just have to be disciplined enough to do it. Finally, last thing you need to do, well, like I said, I've got like 26 others, but the last one in this video is start today, right now. There is not gonna be a better time to start ever than right now, today. So many people are like, ah, I'm gonna do this someday. Well, eventually I'll get this done. And it never happens. They never get anything done. So if you start right now, think about what you want. Think about how you're going to accomplish it. Think about the thing you want the most. So get started today. Take these five tips. Think about what you want and why you want it and understand and have a crystal clear vision of what that is. Understand you can have anything you want. You just can't have it all right now. You'll get there. You'll get it eventually. You just can't have it all right now. Put a photo of the thing you want somewhere where you're gonna see it on a regular basis. Then cultivate the discipline to work to that goal and do it all by starting today. Find that photo, hang that photo up today. Take that as step number one. Do those things and you will be on your way to getting everything you want in life. Like I said, check out the link below. We've got way more. It's my birthday, so I had to do kind of a big post about all the things I've learned in my 31 years. I'm so smart. Oh my God, I'm amazing. No, I'm just kidding. But seriously, go check the post. It's pretty good. If you like this, hit subscribe. Just put a little subscribe link like right there. Hit that. Like right now. Just hit it. Um, tonight, I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing. I think Tate and I are gonna go out to a nice meal for my birthday. All right, so for my birthday, we decided to do a little dinner crawl. So, went to Andina, now heading to the Mediterranean Exploration Company. Food was so good, forgot to take photos of it. Everybody keeps asking me, like, what are you gonna do for your birthday? I was like, I'm gonna work. Because for the last couple days, all I've been doing is hanging out with friends and family and doing fun stuff. So today is a Monday. I've got a word. Tune in tomorrow where I'm going to talk about why I'm starting the blog. I know I told you yesterday I was going to talk about why I'm starting a daily blog, but I wanted this to go along with my birthday post. So instead you get my thoughts on how to get everything you want in life. Tastes pretty good at wrapping.
It's also a little misleading because I think I know what all of the Christmas is. Like. Question is what color are they? Ooh, I got me the blue ones. 